You know what? I would love to play, but uh, right now I'm working at Hooper's. But, but, but can't Alan play school with Elmo and work at Hooper's store? Please, 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 please. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll pretend to be your teacher. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. <laughs> Besides, how hard could it be? Okay, Mr. Allen, Miss, Mr. Ooh, like Allen, that. Elmo's ready. What is Elmo going to do today at school? Mmm. Oh, today? Yep. You are going to draw a picture. Oh, yay! Elmo loves to draw. Great. <laughs> Have fun drawing. Okay. <laughs> well, that wasn't too hard. Yeah. Mr. Allen, Mr. Allen. Uh, uh, yes, Elmo? Well, 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 you forgot to say good morning to the class. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, good morning, class. Good morning, Mr. Allen. Now it's time to draw. Okay. Yes, Elmo? Well, aren't you going to make sure all the students are here? All the students? Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Baby Bear told Elmo that the teacher always calls everyone's name to make sure they're in school. Well, then I better take attendance. Uh, here. Um, Elmo? Here, here. <laughs> Looks like all the students are here today. Yes. Oh, sounds like a customer. Start trying, Elmo. Welcome to Hooper's. What can I get you? I shall have a tuna salad sandwich, please. You got it. See, ah. Here you go. Here's your sandwich. Hmm. On second thought, I would rather have an egg salad sandwich. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, here we go. Egg salad. Hmm. Wait. I changed my mind yet again. I should like to have the tuna sandwich back, please. Uh, the tuna? Mm-hmm. Okay. There you hmm. go. Nah. Egg. Nah, tuna. Nah, egg. Nah, tuna. Mr. Allen! Nah, Mr. Egg. Allen! Uh, well, excuse me. I'll be right back. Okay. Hmm. Tuna or egg? Tuna or egg? Yeah, yeah. Mr. Allen is a really good teacher. What's up, Elmo? Oh, oh, well, Oh, McDonald is here to see Mr. Allen. You can sign me kid up for your school, laddie. Uh -huh. Well, it's, um, not actually a school. Oh, but... don't be modest now, Letty. I hear it's the best school in town, and that's why I'm sending my kid here. <laughs> the... Oh, look, a goat! <laughs> now make sure you listen to your teacher now. Make your farmer proud. Oh, no tears. No tears. Uh, well, wait, wait. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, well, Elmo thinks oh. he wants Mr. Allen to read. Really? Yeah. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 oh, okay, okay. I'll read the book. I'll read the book. Oh, yeah! Right. It's reading time! It's reading time with Mr. Allen! <laughs> All right. Um, tickle the goat. Huh. Tickle the goat's head. Oh, tickle the goat's head, Mr. Allen. Oh, okay. Tickle, tickle. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, he really enjoys this book. Yeah. Oh, keep reading, Mr. Allen. Keep reading. Okay. <laughs> tickle the goat's tummy. Oh, oh. Can, can, can Elmo tickle the goat's tummy, Mr. Allen? Sure, Elmo. Oh, good. <laughs> 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 Boy, goat really loves it when Elmo tickles the book. 
He sure does. <laughs> okay. Let's keep reading. Okay. Tickle the goat's feet. Come on, normal. <laughs> Boy, if you laugh that much when somebody tickles the book, you must really laugh when somebody tickles you. Tickle, 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 tickle. Tickle, 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 tickle. <laughs> or maybe not. Oh, uh, I have to go. You guys draw. Oh, you want to help? Go ahead. Mm. Tuna or egg? Tuna or egg? Hi, uh, what can I get you? Oh, hello. Tuna I'll have a tuna salad tuna sandwich, please. Okay. Tuna? There you go. Oh, thank you. That does it. I shall have the tuna salad as well. Oh, you know what? Bad news. Uh, that was the last of the tuna. Ah, now, what am I gonna have now? This is quite the conundrum. I still have the egg salad. Yes, I shall have the egg salad. There you go. Hmm. Oh, oh my. That looks delicious. Uh, you know what, Storekeep? Hmm. I'll have the egg salad instead of the tuna, please. All right. Wait, wait, wait. If she's going to have the egg salad, then I shall have the tuna. Oh, great. You know what? I'll just switch these. Okay. Oh, oh well, you know, the tuna did look good. And I was starting to like the idea of egg salad. I'll have the tuna. And I shall have the egg. Um, no, uh, wait. Right. Uh, 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 egg? Uh, yes, uh, I'll have the egg. No, no tuna. What? Yes, I'll have the tuna. I'll but, egg, please. No, I'll have the egg. No, I can't have the tuna. Tuna? Uh, tuna or egg. I, um, tuna or egg. It does look delicious, um, though. Egg or tuna. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Brittany, Reuben, are you guys playing school, too? Yes, yes Mr. Mr. Allen. Yes, yeah, yes, but, but, but listen, Elmo has to talk to Mr. Yeah. Allen. Oh. Some of the students are wondering if Mr. Allen is ever going to do the alphabet. Oh, oh, really? You come here, Mr. Allen. Um, um, <laughs> um, Al doesn't want to tell Mr. Allen how to run his school, but um, maybe, maybe Mr. Allen should think about doing the alphabet. Oh, that's good advice, Elmo. Thank you. Yeah, um, Elmo's on your side, Mr. Allen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it's time for the alphabet class. Oh, boy! It's alphabet time at Mr. Allen's school! What a surprise! <laughs> What's, what's going on? We are blowing the celebratory bugle, for we have figured out a way where we can each have both tuna salad and egg salad. Oh, wait, let me guess. You want me to cut each sandwich in half, so you can have one half egg salad sandwich, one half tuna salad sandwich. Hey, oh. that's a Jim Dandy oh. idea, too. Hmm. Uh, why, what was your idea? Oh, it was complicated. Mm. It involved a tractor. Yeah. I'll just cut the sandwiches. Okay. Okay. Here you go. Here's one half egg salad, half tuna salad sandwich for you. Thank you. And one half egg salad, half tuna salad sandwich for you. Nice. Now you can eat. Uh, what about our beverages? Oh, drinks. Ooh. Right. Right. Mm. Um, what would you like? I shall have milk. I shall have milk too. Milk it is. On the other hand, juice would be quite refreshing. I shall have juice. Oh, juice with lunch. How daring. I shall have juice, too. Juice it is. Uh, shake it, thought, make it milk. Yes, milk. milk. No juice. No juice. No milk. Uh, milk. Mr. Allen, no, no, Mr. Allen. No, 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 I'm coming. No, 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 no. Uh, I'll be back. Uh, no, this is a lot tougher than I thought. Uh, no, I changed my mind. Juice. Milk. No juice. juice. Milk, milk uh, or juice. Uh, juice. Uh, <laughs> uh, what's going on now, guys? Whoa. Mr. Allen, Mr. Allen. I commuted all the way from Staten Island because I hear your school has a fantastic rhyming program. What? I do? That's what it says in the brochure. So can we rhyme, please? Oh, 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 okay, 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 yes, 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 we can rhyme. Oh, it's rhyme time at Mr. Allen's school, yeah! Oh, 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 wait a minute. 
guess. What is a rhyme? Oh, well, a rhyme is when two words sound the same, like uh, a blue and shoe. Uh, they both end in an ooh sound. You hear that? Blue shoe. Blue shoe. Hey, they do sound the same. Yeah, well, okay, that's a rhyme. So, I'm gonna say a word, and you all have to rhyme it, okay? Oh, all right, here we go, here we go. Okay, okay. okay. ready? Okay. Great. Cat. Sat. Bat. Rat. Hat. Hat. Albuquerque. Uh, Albuquerque. Uh, Albuquerque. I'm afraid Albuquerque and cat do not rhyme. Oh, I am such a terrible rhymer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's okay. It's okay. It is. Yeah, calm. Breathe. Okay. Breathe. <gasps> Great. All right, we're gonna try it again. Okay? okay. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Tall. Um, fall. Ba. Call. Hall. Hey. Ah. Avocado. Avocado. Uh, well, avocado <laughs> and tall do not rhyme. Oh, I'm never gonna be. Oh, oh, oh. Give up. You can do this. Uh, I can? Absolutely. I know you can. Yeah! Well, if you think I can do it, I'll give it another try. Oh, great. All right, now just remember, for words to rhyme, they have to sound the same. Sound like, the same. yes, like ball and... Tall. Yeah. Ball and tall. Yes. Yeah, yeah, they do sound the same. All right, great. Okay, okay. Let's rhyme, all right? Uh-huh. Dig. Um, oh, fig. Big. Pig. Wig. Texas two-step! Uh, oh, no, wait a minute! I confused my dances! I meant to say jig! Great job, Elephant! Great job! Great job! Thank you! But I couldn't have done it without the greatest teacher in the whole wide world, Mr. Allen! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Allen. Okay. I'll be back. Why are you blowing the celebratory bugle? Oh, well, because I definitely know what I want. I do as well. Oh, great. What is it, milk or juice? Neither. Neither? Well, what do you want, then? We, we want to go to Mr. Allen's school. We saw you teach that elephant how to rhyme. You, my friend, are one fantabulous mm -hmm. teacher. Well, then what about the food? We shall eat it during our lunch period. First, we must learn. Yes, come on. Let's go to school. Yes, let's. Mr. Allen, Mr. Allen. Uh, what is it now, Elmo? <laughs> Elmo finished his picture, and he wants Mr. Allen to have it. Oh, really? There you go. Oh. Look, look, look. It's a picture of Elmo's favorite teacher, Mr. Allen. <laughs> oh, thank you, Elmo. No, no, no. Thank you, Mr. Allen. Thank you for the best day at school ever. You're welcome, Elmo. Bye. <laughs> hey, you Mr. Allen? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm Allen. Well, I'm the new bus driver for your school there. But I don't have a real school. It's just pretend. Well, tell that to the kids. But hi, Mr. Allen. Hi, Mr. Allen. By the way, I hear you're up for Teacher of the Year. Congratulations. You're the man. Ways that you can travel to school, they're all of them fine, they're all of them cool. Now, my friend Jamal always rides a bus, and Liz takes the train to get to school with us. My man Sam always rides his bike, and I can walk the whole way if I like. To school! Some schools are big, and some are small. Some things are the same in any school at all. You can, you can travel, travel far, and you can, can travel, travel wide. wide. You'll always find a classroom there inside. At school! School, you meet kids who become your friends. See them every morning till the school day ends. That's every 
every school, no matter where you turn, you're gonna have a teacher and you're gonna learn at school. No matter how your teacher looks, she'll teach you stuff, she's gonna read you books. Your, your teacher, teacher is smart, your, your teacher, teacher is cool. cool. He'll teach you what he learned when he went to school. You'll draw pretty pictures, hang them on the wall. Play with blocks and build a tower so tall. You'll dance and you'll sing as fine as you please. And learn all your numbers and your ABCs at school. school. Then you'll play outside in the old playground. Jump rope, play ball, or just goof around. Then eat your lunch in a great big space. It's called a cafeteria, a busy old place. At school! At school, At school you'll learn and you'll have fun. And when the last bell rings... That means school is done! Once again for letter of day. Oh boy, oh boy. Me love reaching in cookie jar and wondering what letter of day going to be. Let's see. That, that, let me take a chance on this. Oh, wow. Look at that. That, me think, is, uh, well, look like letter L. Let's see. Yeah, smell like letter L. L, 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 L. -l. Sound like letter L. Yeah, yep. Oh, me know what you're thinking. Cookie Monster going to eat letter of day, right? No. No, today, me different. Me go through sea change. Me going to have willpower. Me no eat cookie with letter L. Yeah, and you know what me going to do? Me going to sing, sing, La, 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 and that start with L. And the more me sing, the more music in me mouth. No cookie in me mouth. Yeah, so me not going to eat cookie. Here we go. Me going to try hard. Mm, oh, you so delicious. Uh, uh, la, 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 La 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 la
was lovely. Another concert by the old monster and a guy named Murray. Oh. Hello, I'm Murray. <laughs> a one, a two. We'll sing a silly song. And you can sing as well. A song that's full of the sound of the letter L. Sing low, 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 low. Liberty Lad Lobster Licking Lap Lap Liberty Lad And that's our silly song And you sing very well With the sounds that are made By the latter L Thank you, thank you That was lovely everyone Now it's time for lunch <laughs> That was a Lulu Hey fellas, wait for me Rolling, 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 little green ball rolling, rolling by. From pod to plate, these circles taste great. You'll love these sweet, sweet peas. Mmm, peas. And now, live from the nursery, it's Baby Fat Domino with his big hit, Shake Your Rattle and Roll. A lot of you babies out there have been lying around on your blankets sucking your binkies. Well, I say babies need exercise too, you know. So come on, if you want to grow up healthy and strong. Sing it, baby! Grab your rattle and baby get ready to shake. Goo, goo, goo. I said grab your rattle and baby get ready to shake. Goo, goo, goo. We're gonna exercise cause it's better than patty cake. You gotta shake your rattle and roll. I said, shake your rattle and roll. Shake your rattle and roll. Yeah, shake your rattle and roll. Exercise is fun, yeah, it's good for body and soul. Hang on to your high chair, cause baby, it's time to bounce. Hang on to that high chair, cause baby, it's time to bounce. Do, do, bounce. If you want to be a toddler, bouncing is what counts. You got to shake your rattle and roll. I said shake your rattle and roll. Shake your rattle and roll. Yeah, shake your rattle and roll. Exercise is fun, yeah, it's good for body and soul. Find your booty, so baby, it's time to kick. Do, do, kick. Mmm, find those booty, so baby, it's time to kick. Do, do, kick. If you want to learn to walk well, kicking can do the trick. Wah, wah. You got to shake your rattle and roll. I said, shake your rattle and roll. Shake your rattle and roll. Yeah, shake your rattle and roll. Exercise is fun, yeah, it's good for your body and soul. There. 
Would you like to know how you're able to jump and run like that? It's your bones and muscles. Your bones support your whole body. <laughs> That's your funny bone. Your muscles allow you to move your bones so that you can do all sorts of things, like walking. And running. Your knees and feet help you jump and help you land safely. We use the bones and muscles in our hands to catch and to throw. Great shot. The calcium in milk keeps your bones strong and healthy. Running and jumping keeps your muscles strong. Did you say jump? <laughs> Hi there. Guess what? I'm in my favorite place in the whole world. Do you know where that is? My room, that's right. I love my room, and there's lots of neat stuff I love to do in my room, too. In my room, I don't twiddle my thumbs. If I get bored, I just play my drums. Grab up the sticks and count to four. And I pound the drums until I can't pound anymore. I go boom, boom, boom. In my room, in my room, I go boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom in my room. In my room, I go boom. There's lots of other neat stuff I like to do in my room, too. In my room with my rubber duck, we like to play with the toy dump truck. Ducky sits behind the steering wheel, and we pretend that the truck is really real and go vroom, vroom, vroom in my room. In my room, we go vroom, 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 vroom in my room. In my room, we go vroom. Ducky. In my room with my hands in my pocket, I can pretend that I'm a rocket. Counting down four, three, two, one, blasting off and having some fun going zoom, zoom, zoom. In my room, in my room, going zoom, 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 zoom in my room. too, you know. Aw, of course it is, pal. Come on, get up, it's time to play. Guess what the game will be today. Come on, get up, it's time to see. Just what the game is going to be. One of these things just doesn't belong. Follow me, get up and dance along. Hello there, it's a sign. 
your furry blue pal Grover here, just back from a quick trip around the world. Did you know that in some places, children ride camels to school? Yes, it is true. I saw it with my own adorable eyes. And today, I am going to ride a camel to school too. Okay, here we go, Sydney. Get ready. Ah! Oh. 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 Let me try this again. Oh. Okay, here we go. Ow! Oh. 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 Mm. Harder than I thought. Now, could you please scooch down the scoot, Sydney? You are a very tall camel. Thank you. That is much better. Yes. Oh, this is going to be great. Okay, here we go. Today is show and tell day, and I wanted you to meet all my friends. Ah, oh, this is <clears> terrible. <throat> there are other ways to get to school, you know. Who said that? <clears throat> what? Watch this. You can take a ride on a great big bus, or take a river taxi in Thailand like us. Or just walking, you know, is quite a popular way to go. Yeah, there's a lot of different ways to get to school. Well, you can hop on a truck, or you can pedal a bike, or toot along in a cart in India if you like, or just walking, you know. It's still a popular way to go Yeah, there's a lot of different ways to get to school Yes, you can go floating, boating, trucking, biking, bussing, walking, laughing and talking How you gonna get there is really up to you Sydney, there are a lot of different ways to get to school all over the world. A plethora of ways, a myriad, a whole kit and caboodle. Hmm. Which to choose, which to choose. Please uh, hurry, I don't want to be late for school. Aha, do not worry, I will get you there. Hop on, Sydney. Oh. <laughs> ah! 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 Next time. Let's take the bus. Okie dokie. <laughs> what do you carry in the top of yours anyway? <laughs> ah, greetings. This is my friend Kale. Hi. Hi, Kale. Kale will attempt the nearly impossible. She is going to try to hop on one foot 11 times because 11 is the number of the day. Ah, ah, ah. She's been training for this for. 11 days, right, Kale? Right. Okay, can she do it? Let's find out. Drum roll, please. That's one, two, three hops, four, five hops, six hops, seven hops, eight hops, nine hops, ten hops, 11, 11 hops, yes, ha, ha, she did it, ha, ha, ha. Oh, there she goes, she's hopping again. There's no stopping her, she is one hoppy kid. Ha, ha, ha. See what the judge says. Eleven! And that's the number of the day! One! Six. 
seven. Just passing by. I'm on my way to the doctor for a checkup. Oh, okay. See you later. Bye, Big Bird. Bye. That's, hey, that's what I'm almost thinking about today. Doctors. Oh, is there a doctor in the house? Did oh, someone call a doctor? Oh, 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 <laughs> you know, doctors. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not a doctor. That's a doctor. <laughs> and a quack. So do your thing, Mr. Noodle. Yeah, what does a doctor do with it? What's the last? Oh. A dog? What's he gonna do with that dog? What's he up to? That's not where it goes. No, you use a leash to walk a dog, not a stethoscope. Mr. Noodle, you don't put it on the dog. You put it on you. Yeah, put the stethoscope on you. Yeah, I have a dog like that. Uh, that's nice, Mr. Noodle. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> He's okay. Go ahead. Put the stethoscope on, Mr. Noodle. Wait, now what's he doing? And it's not a tail, Mr. Noodle. The stethoscope goes in your ears, Mr. Noodle. Put it in your ears. Yeah, your ears. Right, up there. Your ears. Good job. Now he's got it. The stethoscope helps you hear better. Ooh, be careful. A doctor uses it to listen to the heart. Whose heart are you going to listen to, Mr. Noodle? So find somebody. Mr. Noodle's looking around. <laughs> Will he find someone? He's on the move. Mr. Noodle can listen to Elmo's heart. <laughs> Go ahead, Mr. Noodle. No, not there. No! <laughs> 
<laughs> That's not where Elmo's heart is. It's here, in Elmo's chest. Go ahead, Mr. Noodle. Right there. Oh, that's cold. Oh, he's warming it up. Nice, Mr. Noodle. Ah, better. <laughs> good job, Mr. Noodle. Sounds good. Oh, yay! You did it! Way to go, Mr. Noodle! <laughs> now what? Oh, yeah! Listen to your own heart. <laughs> he found his heartbeat. Wow! Mr. Noodle's heart was beating with a rhythm. <laughs> He's doing his thing. Ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-doo-doo-doo. <laughs> He's got the beat. I like the way Mr. Noodle dances. Me too. Uh, Mr. Noodle has a lot of heart and soul. <laughs> oh. What's that, Dorothy? Oh, okay. Dorothy wants to ask someone else. What does a doctor do with a stethoscope? Dorothy, a doctor listens to your heartbeat with a stethoscope like this. Ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. And a doctor also uses it to listen to your lungs. Breathe deep. Breathe deep. Breathe deep. Sounds great. Oh, thanks, everybody. Oh, and thank you, Dorothy. <laughs> oh, now Emma will listen to a baby's heartbeat. <laughs> Hi, Sienna. <laughs> Sienna, where's your heart? Oh, there it is. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Boy, you have a really good heartbeat. <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> Boy, you gotta have heart. <laughs> oh, and now Elmo has a question for uh, 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 you. Yeah, you. How many stethoscopes are dancing in this conga line? Let's count them together and find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight! <laughs> Boy, eight stethoscopes dancing in the conga line! <laughs> and one furry red monster! Oh, great counting, everybody! Elmo and has now... tail! Elmo has mail! <laughs> Elmo has mail! <laughs> Elmo has email! <laughs> Elmo has mail. Oh, look. <laughs> Boy, the computer is playing doctor today. Elmo has mail. Oh, thank you, computer. Oh, it's email from Big Bird. Yay! <laughs> Hi, Elmo. I'm at the doctor's office in the waiting room. I'm waiting to see the doctor. <laughs> hey, gee. I guess that's why they call this the waiting room. <laughs> I like waiting because there's so many great toys in this waiting room, like like this doctor kit. Okay, Radar. Now, I'm Dr. Big Bird, and I'm going to examine you now. First, I'll look in your ear. Aha. Uh -huh. Fuzzy. Just like they should be. <laughs> Big Bird, the doctor will see you now. The Ductor? <laughs> oh, the ductor. <laughs> Gotta go. Bye, Elmo. Oh, oh, thanks, computer. <laughs> Boy, that makes Elmo wonder. Who else goes to the doctor? <laughs> oh, I could say, Elmo met doctor, the doctor. <laughs> who goes to the doctor and who doesn't? Let's find out. Oh, drawer, open up, please. Oh, come on, drawer. Like the doctor says, open up and say, ah! Oh. Do birthday cakes go to the doctor? No. But a doctor can have a birthday. Does a baby go to the doctor? Yes. A baby doctor? <laughs> no, not a baby who is a doctor. 
a doctor for babies and kids, a pediatrician. Oh, a pediatrician! Do elephants go to the doctor? Not like that. <laughs> In a zoo, the animal doctor comes to an elephant. Does a rock go to the doctor? No, rocks don't go to doctors. Unless it's my pet rock, Rocco. Say, ah, uh, Rocco. It's a rock, Zoe. Ah, <laughs> uh, thanks, Troy. <laughs> Elmo's friend Joe went to the doctor for a checkup. And he told Elmo all about it. <laughs> you want to watch too, Troy? Okay. <laughs> Once a year, I go to the doctor for a checkup, just to make sure I'm healthy. My mom always comes with me. Hello. First, the nurse weighed me. Nurses help doctors. Good. Then, she measured me. Turn around. I grew two inches last year. Then, the doctor came in. She asked me to take off my shirt so she could examine me. First, she listened to my heart with a stethoscope. Then, she listened to my lungs. It didn't hurt, but it was a little cold. Then, she looked in my ears. That didn't hurt, but it did a little, little bit. <laughs> She used something called a tongue depressor to look at my throat. The doctor said to stick up my tongue and say, ah, ah. That didn't hurt either. Then the doctor examined the rest of me. My eyes. My stomach. My knees. None of that hurt either. She said I was very healthy. But I needed a shot, so I would stay healthy. That hurt, but only for a minute. And then I got to pick out a sticker, and the exam was over. Mom said she was really proud of me. I was proud of me too. Joe, too. <laughs> now, Elmo wants to learn more about doctors. How can Elmo find out more? <laughs> it's TV. Is TV sick? Does TV need a doctor? No, 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 no. Oh, Elmo gets it. We can watch the doctor's channel. <laughs> Turn yourself on, TV. <laughs> You're watching The Doctor's Channel. Just what the doctor ordered. And now, here's Doc Martin. Give it to us straight, Doc. Hi, Doc Martin here with some doctorly advice. Hit it! You're asking me, Doc, how do I stay strong? Just do the doctor all day long. Do the doctor. Up next on the Doctor's Channel, Doctor No, followed by Doctor Yes. Oh, thanks, TV. Elmo wants to know even hi, more. Hi, Elmo. Oh, hi, Big Bird. Hi, hi, I'm back for my checkup. Oh, how did it go, Big Bird? Well, the doctor says I'm fine and feathered. Oh, good. <laughs> Bye, Elmo. 
Bye, Big Bird. <laughs> Elmo still wants to find out more about doctors. Oh, no. Quack, 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 quack. So, so, sorry, sorry. Elmo meant doctors. Doctors. Quack, 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 sorry. Quack, 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 quack. How can we find out more? Even more. Excuse Elmo. Oh. Uh, want to talk to a doctor? Oh, sure. What's up, Doc? <laughs> uh, well, for one thing, there are lots of different kinds of doctors. Really? Mm. Okay, doctors, the monster will see you now. <laughs> oh, yes, there they come. Okay. Oh. Hey, hey, hi, hi, hi. Hi, man. Hi, doctor. Oh. I am a foot doctor. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of doctor are you? He's not a doctor. He's a monkey. Hey! I'd like a second opinion. You're a monkey. Aw, he's my patient. I'm an animal doctor, a veterinarian. Oh, yeah, even animals have doctors. That's <laughs> right. Dogs, cats, giraffes, whales. Whoa, look, look, look. Dorothy's imagining Elmo as a veterinarian underwater. Hmm. OK, time for your checkup. Open wide and say, ah. <laughs> That goldfish has a whale of an imagination. She sure does. Boy, doctors are great. Oh, Dorothy thinks so, too. That's why Dorothy wants us to sing that doctor's song. Ooh, <laughs> may we sing along, too? Sure. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> do, 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 do. Doctors, 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 doctors. Mm. Sing along. Doctors, 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 doctors. Okay, Slimy, I'll read to you. Just don't say please, okay? Yay! All right, little guy. Here we go. Chapter 453 in The Adventures of Trash Gordon. Yay! When we last left our hero, Trash Gordon, he was trapped on the planet Very Hairy, where the Very Hairians kept bumping into him. They couldn't see because they had hair in their eyes. <laughs> it was a very hairy situation for Gordon. You might even say he was having a bad hair day. <laughs> Luckily, he brought along something he never needed until now. A comb and a brush. Without a second to spare, Trash brushed the hair out of the very Harrian's eyes. And they shrieked and ran away. <laughs> Trash announced heroically. Sesame Street has been brought to you today by the letter L and by the number 11. Now, no more now, Slimy. That's all for now. It's time for you to get some shut eye, little guy. We'll read some more trash tomorrow. Hey, are you still here? I told you, no more trash, Gordon, until tomorrow. Yeah.